All right, Pastor, can you share with us one reason why you love the Bible? Well, I can give you more reasons than one, but one of the first things I uh, I had difficulty reading when I was in when I was in school, and the Holy uh, after I was saved, became uh, filled with the Spirit, I started reading the Bible, and the Holy Spirit used the Bible to teach me to read. Another thing uh, that I love the Bible for is. Uh, I've gotten a lot of comfort from it um, in times when, when I felt troubled or distressed, I would read the Bible and it would bring strength to my inner man. Uh, another reason I love the Bible is because uh, I'm a person of truth. And one thing I just hate is uh, how the enemy has lied uh, to all mankind. Uh, I've heard even Christians uh, say things that are not biblical. And when I've read the Bible, uh, as a matter of fact, this is uh, kind of a humorous thing to me because I remember my grandmother and she would always quote, half quote a scripture. And it was many are the afflictions of the righteous. And so, you know, with that in mind, you think, you know, God's just letting these things happen to us. But as I started reading the Bible, the whole scripture is many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord shall deliver him out of them all. So it's when we discover the truth that the truth makes us free. And you know, one thing that I've I've come to find out uh, is that you, it's like you said, it's alive and active. It's sharper than any two edged sword. Like I will read a scripture verse and it jumps out to me. It's exactly what I needed at that moment. Or there are other scripture verses that I may read quite a number of times, but in that one instance when I read it, it just jumps out to me and is exactly what I need in that moment. Uh, so thank you so much for sharing about your personal experience with the Bible, and I encourage you to, to find pleasure. your own. My pleasure.